several things don't quite seem to add up. For instance, the pilot ejected from a plane that was capable of still flying in autopilot mode for quite some time. So why would the pilot have to eject himself if the plane could still fly? And then also, what was the mishap that occurred which led to the so-called incident which led to the pilot ultimately having to eject himself? Now, one theory I've seen floating around there is that the problem had to do with the oxygen delivery system in the cockpit, which is apparently a problem that these fifth generation fighters are known to have. In fact, here's an excerpt from a U.S. Air Force report. It came following the crash of an F-35 over in Florida, which happened three years ago, which was partly caused by the life support system. Likewise, in that earlier crash in Florida three years ago, besides the oxygen issue, there were also several technical deficiencies with the plane. And if you thought that was interesting, well, hit that subscribe button and get more videos just like this.